So I'm in here at Rafa's garage. I was going to swap out the rears, the rims in the rear, and take off the coals off that car. But something came up, and I'm going to put my ported headers I had. These I ended up selling to Mark. Mark gave them back to me, and I need to install these today because somebody wants an OEM 2ZZ headers, so I got to take off those and get rid of those. So I'm gonna do today. So this is my engine bay, CF everywhere. Um, to do this job, I have to remove the C1 strut bar right there um, and remove the header bolts. Uh, luckily, I have no shield. Um, gotta remove the two in the bottom. Luckily, it's already in jacks. Usually, when I do this, I take off the axle and the bracket. Hopefully, I'm gonna try to do it without it because I don't want to drain the oil off my tranny because I have good oil on it. So I'm gonna try it like that. If not, I would have to take it off to make it easier, but we'll see. So the header's off, but I got no space. The axle's in the way right there. Tomorrow I'll take it off because um, I don't have a size 32 or 30. Um, it's at the shop. So tomorrow I'll bring it, plus I need to hammer some stuff, and it's kind of late. Don't want to wake up the neighbors, so I'll finish it off tomorrow. Gonna finally take off the axle. I actually got the size for this, and I got the impact gun, brought it from the shop. I'm also gonna take off the rims, the back rims off of this one, and the back rims off of this one, and the back rims off my girl's car, and take off the suspension off of this so I can sell the coal overs and you already know what I'm gonna do rims from there going on to here rims from here going on to there and those are going over there so hopefully I get it done tonight the headers off the only reason I'm not putting it on right now is because I have to special order the gasket it'll be here Friday I was gonna use the oil but there was dirt in there Rim is already off. I'm gonna take this rim off. One coil is already out. We just need to work on the other one. And this is the stock suspension. And I don't know where my girl put the other coil. So the only reason I'm not going walking through you, I'm not walking you guys through this, is because I already done this already. Finally, I was able to get my header gasket so that's what we're gonna do today slap it on my baby put those ported headers on and call it a day maybe swap out the rims i got a lot of stuff to do so keep you guys posted so the headers in already it's right there. I just need to put two nuts and one screw on the top and tighten them up and put the oil and the axle. So I'm done with the top. I tightened the bolts on the three on the top. Put the C1 bar already because I'm going to need it. Uh, now I have to go down under there and put the ones in the bottom. Tying up the bottom ones and put all these brackets I took off. One for the header, one for the axle, and then do the axle. So I'm soaking wet from my back. <laughs> I was laying on the ground. My girl opened up the hose and all that water goes from there all the way down there and I got soaked wet. <laughs> sorry uh, sorry <laughs> <laughs> um, so the bottom done is already done I just gotta do the axe over there uh, I'm not gonna finish it today reason being is because I forgot to put grab the hose to put the oil in or the pump uh, for the tranny oil so 
That's the only thing I'm gonna not gonna do. So I'm gonna put the axle, the hub, the wheel, drop it, and tomorrow I'll put the oil. I'll probably do the rims, maybe. I doubt it, because I gotta go change. So, see you guys tomorrow.